ourselves down here. I'm in my backup washroom, so my skincare washroom. Just to show you guys what I mean by skincare washroom. If this is all the stuff I bought from Asia because I am insane. No, honestly. Like this is my restock cabinet. I have like all these face masks. So I bought all this back from Asia and I ran out, I emptied all of my current skincare, so we're gonna pick new stuff to bring over to the other side. Um, so I still have a cleansing oil on the other side, and I still have a cleansing balm, so that's my double cleanse, and that's fine. That's going well. Um, I do want a cleansing foam, I think. So I have either this or this. I don't remember which one this was. I'm gonna say... I wanna say this. I wanna try this. Okay. Okay, in terms of uh, toner and incense, I actually have PR. So, thank you so much to Haru, Haru Haru Wonder. So, I've actually tried their products before and I absolutely loved it. Um, and they sent me this time the, um, I believe the black rice essence. Yeah, so just little unboxing here. They had like little cards, little notes, and it really shows, describes the products to you. So I really like that. So they sent me the black rice probiotic uh, berry essence. Um, they also sent me the Black Rice Bakuchiol ice, uh, Eye Cream and the Black Rice Hyaluronic Toner. So you know what, I'm gonna use the toner and their essence. I'm gonna do that combination. I'm for sure gonna use the eye cream. Um, and then I need a moisturizer. Um, okay, so moisturizer I have. So this went viral not too long ago. It's called the Sleep and Sleep frozen mask. I, I used one, but it's very light, so I like using it in the summer instead. Then, in terms of other options, I have the Centella one um, from Skin 1004. So I either have the Hyaluronic one or the por Poromizing Light Gel Cream. Gel is very light for me and we're getting dry season. So let's see. Um, we have the Industry Collagen Green Tea one or even this is a Bija Trouble Lotion though, so I'm not sure. I think I'm gonna use actually, and we're gonna use the Hyaluronic one, so it gives me moisture. And I have the eye cream, so that's fine. I'm running out of that. This is a class, but I, can, I still have some. I still have the uh, Skin 1003 sunscreen, so that's fine. I have all of the rest. Okay, so I think we're gonna rotate in these products here, right here, and I think we're gonna do a face mask. I'm trying to be more, you know, winter. We're doing the winter arc, so I'm trying to be more strict with myself. I want to work, get back to routine workouts, um, daily, daily a regular like face mask and stuff. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put this in the fridge and prep all of that. So we're gonna go do that. And I'm gonna go prep these in my main bathroom. So we're gonna take you along. Um, yeah, so I haven't been really like consistent in the last couple of weeks just cause after the move, I was like, oh no, like, I have so much to do, so, oh god, there you go, um, so I feel like now I'm kind of like settling in, oh my god, that means I can like 
set myself up. Okay, so there's also this trend on TikTok where you do multiple toners and apparently it works really well um, to get glass skin. So, I mean, I use two toners liquid and one toner pad already and it, it feels really good. So I'm really excited to be able to use these as well. Oh my God, look at her. Thank you, Haru Haru. Like, this is gorgeous. Okay, the Essence one is gonna be here. The last time I tr used it, it was really good for my skin. I think it was also, I used their toner last time, but I don't think it was the same formulation. This is for sensitive skin, which is really good. I have occasionally rosacea, so that is something I need to work. Find a solution to occasionally, especially during the dry months. I love the Haru Haru Wonder packages. Like it's so cute. Um, so yeah, wait. Um that's gonna be my eye cream there. I'm trying to Okay, this is my new rotation, guys. Okay, so the main skincare that I just brought. So this is my first toner. I still have my second toner. This is the Essence, the cleansing oil, the cleansing balm, the new smaller toner, the eye cream. This is my old eye cream. I'm almost out, so that's gonna be replaced by the Haru 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 Wonder. So these three. Um, the Innisfree one is here as well. But yeah, no, like, thank you Haru Haru Wonder for renewing my skincare routine this month. That's my leftovers, like, you see, I'm almost out, so I'm gonna finish using those. The top is my, my hair care. Guys, update, it took me an hour to decide on the design here and basically an idea struck me i have so many jelly cats what if i draw jelly cats on the menu so i got my um my ipad and thank god on canva you can draw so oh my god morning guys um I decided I can't survive without coffee before 1 p.m. So, we got some coffee beans this weekend, remember? Um, so, I'm opening the El Faro Colombia. It's cranberry, cherry, gooseberry, and chocolate. And we're gonna probably use these beans for the housewarming as well. So, little. Oh wow, it smells so good. Look at that little bean. I just fill that up as much as I can. That should be good. Spread it out a bit. Then that's it. So she's ready. Okay, guys, 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 quickly. This is the rest of the Amazon Prime Day order. Oh my God, why is there a box? <laughs> okay. So we got the Fire TV stick for the projector. What is this? Oh, the Swifter for cleaning and we got this more boring stuff but we got some of the filters for our air purifier so those need to change but this means we can put together a projector and i'm very excited about that 
Okay, let's go do that. Okay guys, we're gonna set up the projector. So this is the one we got from Amazon. So during the sale, it was, I think 130, 130 something. But let's unbox her. Let's see, oh, there's like a cleaning swab. Quick start guide, obvious cables, a remote, and more cable actually. HDMI cable if needed. The thank you. And there she is. Okay, guys. Look at this. Isn't it cool? Woo. Okay. So let me quickly take a look at this guide. No, that's the frame. Is it doing something? No, it's, it changes how folks. Two hours later. We like that. There you go. <laughs> this is perfect. Oh my god, this is so perfect. Hello guys, welcome back to the vlog. So today, I'm gonna get take you guys along on our housewarming. So we just moved to this new apartment. It's a tall building, it's bigger space, and we wanted to host a little housewarming, but not like a housewarming. It's basically just an excuse for us to have our friends over and just have them have coffee, share some pastries and all that. So we're prepping that the night before because tomorrow's Saturday morning. So the event is gonna be from 10.30 to 3.30. We made a cute menu and all that. We'll show you guys tomorrow. Um, and we're pre-baking some of the stuff because we decided to offer like five different types, no, five, yes, five different types of pastries. So we have croissants. We're gonna have three types of cookies. We're gonna have brownies and then we're gonna have muffins. So we need to bake all of that and make sure it's ready for tomorrow morning. Um, so, was that six? Three cookies. Wait, cookies, croissant. I am so sorry, I do not know how to count. Six. Um, it's late, it's one of those things. So we're baking some of it tonight and we're prepping some of the, the batters for tomorrow morning baking. Croissant, we got us, we got them from Costco, so like it's just put, make sure it's defrosted and then bake it, so that's perfectly fine. Um, the cookie batters, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make all three cookie batters, put them, make them into little balls, and then we're gonna keep them in the fridge and then bake them tomorrow morning. So what we need to do is actually make muffins and the brownies as well tonight uh, from start to finish, because if anything, I wanna add a little bit of, um, um, I want to add frosting. English, come on. Uh, frosting on the muffins tomorrow morning. So they need to be like cooled. Um, and usually brownies as well sets really well once cooled. So that's why we're doing those two tonight. So we're going to show you guys the chaos that it is. But it's going to be so, so, so worth it. It's going to be super cute tomorrow morning. So yeah.
guys. So it's the morning of the housewarming. We just woke up really early, um, got everything cleaned, and we are going to basically start setting up all the pastries and like get make sure that everything's ready for the coffee, the nachos, and all of that. So we're just gonna show you them. I would have cried if that fell. Okay, runner. Yeah. On the table, this is the white runner that we have. So, table. And yeah, I think pretty much everything else is ready. We need to start baking though, like the cookies and stuff. So, hopefully that won't take too long. Okay, let me see. Okay. Okay, so I need to drizzle something on this. So until I'm done, I'm not going to put them over. Can you get me some sugar, please? Icing sugar. Okay, can you get this and start on the cookies, please? Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Basil. So, these are our batters. Let me show you what we're working with here, guys. So we have matcha, regular chocolate chip. Um, this is uh, red velvet, but with the cream cheese in the middle. So we're gonna have salt over this. We're gonna have cho white chocolate, bigger chunks in the middle in that one. And this is gonna be these chunks in the middle. So these are our cookies that we need to bake this morning the muffins that we need to ice a little bit, a little drizzle. And we also have our croissants that are currently rising. And we have our brownie, which we did this time. So, brownie here. We need to cut it into squares and we'll be ready. So let's do that. Okay guys, we have the menus here. I'm gonna stick one up here, so let's try to visualize with me here. Okay. I think this one, we'll put it like right here. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. I don't know where the two small ones. Like, I don't wanna, I wanna support them on something, or maybe. Hmm. Yeah. Like something to lean, perhaps. Yeah. Is this straight? I think so. I think so, yeah. These are custom made menus. Spent two hours on them. So, very excited. Look at that. Hey, isn't that cute? Oh, that's so cute. Perfect. Okay, basil. I'm debating putting one like on the wall here. That's small. Maybe put one on the table, like just on the corner or something. We need to find something to support the smaller menus. Um, okay, wait. 
think we're gonna put it in this corner, like standing like that. I just need to find something to support it. <laughs> and I can always use like more candles, but that was not the goal. Um, interesting. Do I use candles? Well, yeah. I'm not gonna light it. Oh, it kind of works, guys. No, I do not want to tape it on. It's gonna be flimsy. Like that, I think. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay, guys, so one menu on the fridge, one menu beside the coffee nook. And then one menu on our table with a food display. So that's kind of what she's looking like. We'll fill her out. I don't know where it is. I haven't seen it. Well, it's not where it's supposed to be anyway. Okay, so test. I'm going to try to drizzle over this. That's kind of cute. Very cute. Very cute. Okay, I think that much is enough to put out. I'm gonna put these somewhere else for now. Because guys, look at this. I think that's enough for the display. I'm gonna keep these muffins for backup. So let's go put this on the other stuff. Uh, do you want to put a chunk on top of each? Um, or you want to keep it the there? chunks are gonna be for the other ones, just matcha ones, gotcha. yes. this bad boy okay guys so i like using this to cut the gorgeous look at that Oh. That's good. Yeah. And we're gonna put her on the other side. Okay, we now have the gorgeous muffins. The gorgeous. Why am I having a braid fart? Brownies. Brownies. Yay. Yeah. Now we have these. And then those are gonna go into the oven to bake soon. Yes. There you go. Okay, so let's get our milk options out. We're gonna do a pistachio, an oat, macadamia. Regular milk will be in the fridge, but yeah, pretty much like that. First batch of cookies are out. Woo. That's perfect, actually. We're gonna let them cool for a little bit and then we'll take them off. 